Let's press Odegaard be the trigger. Let's get into mm. into the, the Man City team. Yeah, absolutely. You might hear a bit of uh, applause around as Gabriel Martinelli is making his way towards us and will join us very shortly to give his perspective. The match winner today with that deflected shot, Gabriel. Very nice to see you. Thank you for joining us on NBC. Uh, how does that feel? Feels great. Feels great to be back with the team and playing against City. We know that is is a good side, a tough time, a tough team to play against. And yeah, we did well and great win. How, how did you feel coming on? You must have been. You looked the first five minutes when you came on. You looked so excited. You were <laughs> trying to do everything after yeah. the injury. Yeah, since the day I picked the injury, I was just waiting for this moment and trying to be with the team and yeah today I did it and I helped the team and so happy with the victory. Was there a plan before the game of how many minutes you could play? Were you happy to play 45 or was there a little bit less maybe from the manager wanted? No to be fair we didn't have a plan I was just on the bench and if the team needed me uh, I would be ready to to go and help them. So when you're watching from the sidelines what was the message to to you at half time from Mikel Arteta is there anything that you saw in the game that you thought I can I can capitalize on this? No, he just said, go there and do your thing. See, simple as that. Yeah. <laughs> and with the, tactically, so we were doing the, the commentary upstairs, and in the second half, it looked like your mentality as a team was more aggressive. The press, Martin Odegaard pushing in more. Was that, was that part of the plan before the match, to play the second half more aggressively than the first half? Yeah, I think if, if you want to, to win against them, we, we have to give everything, and we did it so well in the second half. Uh, in the first half as well, but in the second half more. And yeah, as I said, uh, we won the game and this is the most important thing. Of course, you're used to celebrating victories at Arsenal, but victories over Manchester City have been very rare. So what's the plan tonight in terms of celebration? <laughs> my, my whole family is here, my mum, my dad, my, my missus and some friends as well. So I think I'll just stay at home, have dinner with them and enjoy this moment. These young professionals. Uh, it, very different from your day, <laughs> Graham. Well, uh, there is some added celebration here because you are the player of the match, Thank and you. it shouldn't be me that presents it, but a former England left back. So please do the honours. Congratulations. Thank congratulations. You. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Gabriel Martinelli joining us pitch side after he scored the decisive goal in this 1 0 victory over Manchester City here at the Emirates. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.